your exclusive AccuWeather forecast from KTVO. Welcome back, folks. Tonight we're going to have partly cloudy conditions and it will be very breezy. Currently in Kirksville, it's 49 degrees, humidity at 40%, dew point at 26, winds out of the southeast at 9, and the barometric pressure is falling. In Atumwa, the city of Bridges, it is 49 degrees, humidity at 35, dew point at 20. Three, actually, I apologize. Winds out of the east southeast at nine, and the barometric pressure in Atumwa is falling as well. Well, looking at as we put the regional sat rad in motion, you can see we have some clouds and precipitation coming into the heartland, which will give us a chance over the next couple of days of some showers, but nothing that's going to really bump up our precipitation level. For Sunday, we can expect a nice day all across the heartland. Here's that low pressure system with the precipitation chances, but we're really not going to see anything. As you can see, it's more towards the Quad City in the northeastern portion of Iowa. So overnight tonight we can experience partly cloudy conditions, breezy, a low of 43 degrees, winds out of the south between 10 and 15 miles per hour, but those gusts will be up to 20. For tomorrow morning, as we are waking up, it's going to be mostly cloudy, a uh, low of 45 degrees, but by 10 a.m., partly sunny skies with a high of 50. For tomorrow afternoon, mostly sunny skies, chance of showers, a low of 58 degrees, actually a high of 58 degrees and winds out of the south southwest 16 to 20 miles an hour with gusts up to 28. So be careful if you're driving out there because it will be very windy tomorrow night. Mostly clear, chilly. The cold is going to come and it is here to stay for a while. Low of 32 degrees winds out of the west between 5 and 10 miles per hour. So as the surface map moves in motion, you can see what we have this low pressure system coming into the heartland. It does have this cold front associated with it that's going to keep us chilly. And then we have another one that's coming back, but that's really not going to affect us real in the near future. So right now we're just going to have mild uh, temperatures for Halloween. But look, as we go into early next week, the jet stream is right over southeast Iowa in northeast Missouri, right in our viewing area. But I'll step aside because in case you're traveling anywhere in the country, you can see they are still having some chilly conditions up in the northeast, but nice and pleasant conditions in the southwest. Well, folks, here is your exclusive AccuWeather five day forecast. As you can see on Sunday, partly cloudy skies, a chance of showers, a high of 58 degrees, but we will see a cold low 32. But look at Halloween. It's going to be nice and sunny with a high of 62 degrees. And as we go into Tuesday, it will be a chilly 43 degrees. Our precipitation chances will continue on Wednesday and Thursday with a 40% chance on both days, but it will be very chilly with a high of 59 on Wednesday and a high of 49 on Thursday. And of course, folks, you can get your forecast 24-7 at heartlandconnection.com.